Welcome back students. Upon the request of many students, I have come up with the important questions and concepts for the course Material Science and Metallurgy under JN2H R18 Regulation for Mechanical Engineering students. The first and foremost question I have taken into consideration is volume defects in materials and point defects along with its neat sketch and the slip systems and the properties from this we can expect one A dear students for sure. Later calculate atomic packing. A uh, factor for BCC and FCC is also said to be very important and gunshot question. I also write a short notes on ceramics and point versus line versus interfacial defects. If you are working with this point defects, the same question may be uh, taken into consideration here. From this part, you can expect one BDS students. Now, I am going to let you know the second question. It is all about the importance of critically resolved shear stress and derive equation for CRSS is said to be very, very important and gunshot question and dislocation of strengthening mechanism may be the B question and the imperfections in solids and density calculation of crystal structures. From this part we can expect 2A as well as 2B dear students. We can expect this should be a gunshot question and this also should be a gunshot question. Please do work out accordingly and it is scoring subject and it is all about the theory and I have uploaded a video on how to write a theory subject which is uploaded in my channel. Please go through it and score good marks. Second unit also consists of two questions in your question paper. Draw a phase diagram for two metals A and B which are soluble in each other at all compositions is said to be very important and gunshot question malleable cast iron versus white cast iron and the differences with respect to composition microstructure and properties dear student for each and every material in this material subject science uh, you are supposed to work out the all the properties as well as compositions of various materials benite discuss the formation of benite from austenite is said to be also very important calculate percentage amount of ferrite Proitotite, ferrite, and cementite in 0.6 percent steel is said to be asked several times. From this part, we can expect 3A as well as 3B dear students. Sometimes from the unit 2, you are going to get only one and a half question as per the analysis done by me taking into consideration the previous year question papers. Also, work out and draw the carbon, I mean Fe, Fe3C, or ion ion carbide diagram. And and all invariant reactions is said to be very very important and gunshot question ferrite austenite perlite as well as all the remaining this all uh, material differences between with respect to this composition microstructure and the properties i hope you are working out all the properties and microstructures need to be drawn only in pencil eutectide as well as eutectic reactions is said to be very important and describe the amount of structure for changes at that occur during cooling of 0.4 uh, carbon steel from a liquid state is said to be also very important and gunshot question and the differences between different reactions and we can expect one and a half question this time from the unit 2 dear students. Later unit 3 is all about the normalizing versus annealing as well as hardening and their differences. Sometimes they will be asking you to work out two types of annealing as well as hardening types and the methods is very very important from this part you will be getting one question for sure. Transformation of perlite along with its diagram and tempering treatment of steels and microstructure development and isothermal transformation diagram is said to be a gunshot question for iron carbon alloys. From this part you are going to get one question I can say that that is 5A as well as 5B. Next triple T diagram for a eutectotide eutectoid steel and label each and every part of it and Jomni and quench test hardenability of steel or they may be asking the test for hardenability of steel you are supposed to work out Jomni and quench test along with its knee diagram and tempering versus periodizing in differences and why quenching isn't done after night riding this may be said to be a 6a as well as 6b dear students in your question paper these all are the very important questions please do work out very neatly and do not forget to carry your calculator also sometimes the one problem will be asked as well as pencils draw all the diagrams only in pencil and label them in the unit 4 you will be getting sometimes one and a half question why because it is too lengthy in its structure critical cooling rate and its importance and carbon nitriding explain this as well as the differences and the diagram and the importance of cct versus triple t and case hardening classify and its method is said to be very important question flaming versus inductioning hardening or vacuum versus plasma hardening from these two part you will be getting one question 
for show dams dear students and cct diagram of eutectite steel and carburizing and its types and os tempering versus mart tempering is said to be also very important question from this part you'll be getting one and a half question i mean 6b or as well as or 67a as well as 7b sometimes as per the analysis done by me taking into consideration previous year question papers sometimes even in from the unit 5 also they ask one and a half question whereas from the third and second unit they have asked only one one question and the stainless steel and the tool steels is said to be very important and gunshot question of 8a and the properties and uses and tool steel types along with its composition microstructure as well as properties of tool steels is very important and necessity of alloying steels and the types and the ductile iron versus grey cast iron their differences and tool steel versus die steels is said to be very important question later write a short notes on brass or bronze or copronical they may be asking you for seven and eight combination or just a seven mark and what are margining steels to list out the copper alloys and their importance along with aluminium copper composition properties and application dear students if you look at the paper where i am stressing all the things related to the properties applications and compositions of various material signs i mean the metallurgy materials malleable cast iron versus i mean the gray and white cast iron as well as periodical cast irons and their structure and properties said to be very very important question and magnesium alloy versus titanium alloys and their differences these all are said to be very important and you can work out at least a minimum of 3 units to score good marks out of out mark as per the covid pattern you will be asked eight questions of which you are supposed to answer any five please do work out very neatly and do concentrate and each and every part which i have highlighted as said to be important questions and do not forget to subscribe to my channel as i am going to upload the next semester videos as well as many important concepts as well as the education related to engineering in this channel please do subscribe to my channel as well as share and like as well as comment if you are looking for any course thank you